When Mexico sends its people, they're not sending their best. They're sending people with lots of problems. They're bringing drugs. They're bringing crime. They're rapists. Wrong, wrong, wrong. In fact, Mexican immigrants are not more criminal than natives, but less. Mexican immigrant men aged 18 to 39 are less than half as likely to be incarcerated as native-born males. So it's not strange that crime levels in the United States have plummeted while immigration has surged. Of the 10 safest cities in the United States, seven have very large Hispanic immigrant populations. Mexico doesn't decide which individuals to send. Immigrants self-select. And while they may not be the best according to Donald Trump, they are the most ambitious. And that's why they're overrepresented in one statistic, the one on labor market participation. They want to improve their lives and they want to work hard. Sure, immigrants turn to crime more in some countries, but that happens to be the countries that do what Donald Trump wants to do, the countries that discriminates against them and doesn't allow them to work. 